To submit work to Turnitin, make sure you are logged into Moodle 2. The course overview will prompt you of any Turnitin assignments that need attention within a Moodle course, such as here. Clicking the little Turnitin icon will reveal a summary of that particular Turnitin assignment, indicating the due date and time, and here the fact that no submissions have yet been made to this assignment. To submit work to Turnitin, enter the Moodle course, identify the correct Turnitin assignment within the Moodle course. Moodle courses can contain multiple Turnitin assignments, so please check with your tutor to ensure you're submitting your work to the correct one. Click to enter the Turnitin assignment. It's advisable to check the assignment start date as you will not be able to submit work before the start date. To submit your work, click on the submit paper link here. If this is your first time using Turnitin within Moodle 2, you may be asked to read and accept the latest Turnitin user agreement before you can make a submission. To enter a suitable submission title. The submission title is mandatory as indicated by the little red star here. Next you need to add your work to the box here either by dragging and dropping from your file browser window into the box or using the add file link here. To drag and drop, simply drag and drop your assignment into the box and make sure that you tick the little confirmation checkbox at the bottom of this window here. Again, this is a mandatory thing and it must be checked for your submission to be uploaded to Turnitin. Once done, click the Add Submission button and your work will be uploaded to Turnitin. If your su submission was successful, you're presented with a digital receipt screen as shown here, which indicates your submission has successfully been uploaded to Turnitin. It contains a Turnitin submission ID number and a submission extract. There is no need to print this digital receipt at this stage as you'll be given the opportunity to do so later. Click the close button in the top right of the screen your submitted work should now be visible as shown here along with a similarity score. If for some reason your assignment doesn't appear, click the refresh submissions link to refresh the view. Please be aware that tutors can choose to hide similarity scores so if in doubt check with your tutor. If you wish to print out and keep your digital receipt as proof of submission, you can do so by clicking the View Digital Receipt link here. This again will give you an option to click and print out your digital receipt.